Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Decent We Are Poppers, and we're at the King Children Launch Event, and I'm standing right next, well, sitting right next to probably one of the most phenomenal performers I've seen thus far this year, and no, I'm not exaggerating. Give it up for Baby Yours. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, baby, may I call you yes. baby? Yes, you may. How, how did you come about being affiliated with King Children and all of this? Say festivity and you know, pageantry because this is an awesome event, this is an awesome space, and you just gave an awesome performance. So, how does it all tie in to tonight's events? Um, I, my friend, uh, my friend Rocky actually introduced us, and then uh, the guys have been doing a lot of things with Treble. Mm -hmm. Treble is a community of musicians based in Brooklyn, and I perform there a lot, and King Children has been involved as well for a few months. So, we've been you know bumping to each other and yeah, we became friends with the founders and stuff. So I'm awesome. Happy to be here. I have a few videos. They're great. As you can see, phenomenal specs. But um, so, tell us a little bit more about your style and uh, your brand of music because your performance was very, very captivating. Like I said, and gave us a little bit of I want to say Bowie, a little bit of Jagger. <laughs> saw some Liza and Streisand thrown in, you know, just a little bit. We, you know, pizzazz. We did it all in Platform Hills, you know, <laughs> which was amazing in itself. So, where's some of your influences, and you know, how did you take them all and become you know, the artist and performer that you are today? Thank you. Um, I get a lot of inspiration from jazz music and jazz musicians. I think um, I've evolved a lot in in sessions where we just improvise a lot. Mm -hmm. So I feel like a lot of my music is born out of those sessions. You know, you just start playing one instrument, then another instrument, and then I start singing. And then we, we usually record everything. So at the end of the day, I've, I listen to everything that we've created and, you know, pick the things that I like. So I don't really think of one musical style when I'm writing. Um, I just really like to start with one instrument, you know, guitar or piano usually. And from there, I feel like if, if a song can live in that place, then it can translate into a bigger production. One of your visuals that I recently saw and I really, really enjoyed is the Go Go Girl video. So elaborate, so big, it was something, I want to say it was like posed it was on steroids. You know, it was a lot of elegance, and a lot of theatrics. What was the concept behind putting that whole video together? How did you pull it off? Um, I think the song and the visuals were very much one one thing together. You know, when I created the song, I think that the visuals were attached to it right off the bat. Um, so I just found a really great team of people that uh, that were very open to, to making this vision come true. So um, I think I got very lucky in that sense. A bunch of friends who are artists, they all came together and, you know, brought their looks and their talents and made it possible. We did it with a very small amount of money, but very little resources, but everyone brought so much in that, as you said, it ends up being this really epic production, um, but it's it's all just from the heart of all these artists, which feels very special to me. Our community, you know, very, very big these days because it's about togetherness, it's about practice, something that everybody can feel attached to. And something this big and something this epic I feel like you guys kind of hit the mark of showing something that had never been seen before but also having it come from the heart and having it be super super genuine we can see it in your music and your performances so what's on the horizon for you? I definitely want to keep expanding my my music and the artists that I'm working with I have a bunch of collaborations coming with the producers that I'm working with a lot of performances Quinn and I we're going to be performing a lot we're going to be traveling a lot hi Quinn um, he's a Quinn Devlin he's actually an incredible musician he has a great project out in the big kind of his music and he him and I we're going to be doing what we did tonight a lot we're going to be traveling a lot and I'm going to be going more to LA and uh, yeah, just expanding, making more music, more visuals, more music videos, um, 
play more with fashion, which is something that I love, and I always, it's always fun, you know? What an easy jacket, by the way. Thank you very much. Thanks to ASOS. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I have good stuff. Awesome. I like it. Where can people find you at on social media? Social media, baby yours. That's B A B Y, baby. Y O R S. Yours. That the U. You know. Yes. That's it. And then babyyours.com. Um, at baby yours for everything else. Thank you so much for taking time out to talk to us. Ladies and gentlemen, baby yours. Make sure you get the music. Make sure you live the experience. Make sure you support the brand. Yeah. Once again, it's been decent for Pop Dust. Yeah. King Children. Yeah. Yeah.